All right, so I picked up another property. This one's a little one. It's only 728 square feet. Uh, it's got this old wood paneling. I guess which was original. Actually, the lady I bought it from was the original owner, which was kind of neat. But uh, this house was full of stuff, but luckily she moved it all out. And this room, I think, has like two layers of the wood paneling. But luckily there's drywall behind it. Bathroom, seen better days. Got a constant drip there, and this will have to be ripped out. New toilet, all that stuff. This one still has a bed in it. And like a dresser. It's got window units. I guess there's an issue with the AC, but it does have a normal AC system. It's just the AC part isn't working. Kitchen, nice and small. So cabinets are actually not in bad condition. Same with the countertops. So definitely good enough for a rental. Some cabinets left here. It's on a half acre, so that's kind of nice. Roof is newer. They did, um, they were using part of the garage as a bedroom. They had like a bed right here and they put up this wall in between that's like a com. I think it's styrofoam. It's like wood paneling with styrofoam in the middle. And in here there's no light, but it's the garage part. Another window unit. So one of the first things you're going to want to do when you pick up a house is change out the locks. Um, so that you don't have somebody coming back and living in it, especially if it was a rental or they were renting out rooms. Like this lady was renting out rooms. So I don't want any of those people to come back and be able to get into the house also, which I don't have with me, but you're going to want to get bug bombs. Because usually, like you can see here, uh, there were pets in the house and sometimes they leave fleas or whatever. So you're going to want to get rid of all the bugs in the house. So as you can see, I've got my handy dandy trailer and uh, I'm just going to go ahead and start removing some of the clutter in here. The chairs, I'm going to get rid of the bed first. Um, some of the heavier stuff I'll have to have somebody come by and help me with, but generally just want to try and empty the place out. The next will be removing all the wood paneling and checking out the appliances whether they're reusable or not and I'm gonna have somebody else do the shower I just really don't feel like dealing with it um, so I'll get them out and they'll tear this out and redo it put a new tub in so as you can see here behind it there's a drywall and it's got the uh, orange peel texture on it so hopefully it'll be as easy as just removing it putting new baseboard down and painting it um, the popcorn ceiling I'll leave however I think it was in here there's some damage from when the roof was leaking now it has a new roof on it there's some more there so depending on how big of an area has to get scraped out to fix that will determine whether or not it'll need to be retextured which if I'm gonna retexture it I might as well just get rid of the popcorn and do knockdown so to wrap it up pretty much just you know change out the locks every time do your bug bombs just start emptying out the basic stuff in the house and get your lockbox on so you can start having contractors or plumbers or whoever come by and start giving you prices because you want to get these houses livable quickly or remodel depending on if you're flipping it or not and so you can either get a tenant in or your new owner to buy it you want to turn your investment quickly thank you for watching please subscribe hit the like button comment down below do you guys have any rentals or do you guys flip houses do you want to learn about it whatever you got just uh, comment down below and I'll see you guys in the next video thanks guys take care